Well, Illinois has the highest number of measles cases of all U.S. states, but officials say they have been handled well. WGN's Jenna Barnes joining us with what's being said about the recent spike and the outlook for the summer months. Hi, Jenna. Hi, Micah and Ray. Today, the leaders of the state and city public health departments met with the leaders of eight Chicago hospitals, calling their collaborative response to this outbreak a success. Hi, I'm uh, Samir Vora, the director of the Illinois Department of Public Health. The heads of the Illinois and Chicago Departments of Public Health taking a victory lap on their response to the ongoing measles outbreak. The response has been swift um, and although more work needs to be done, uh, is continuing to show its effectiveness. This is a success story of how we were able to stop um, for the spread of measles in a very challenging context. Nationwide, measles cases are already about double the total for all of last year, and Illinois has the most of any state with 64. 58 of those cases in Chicago, two in suburban Cook County, two in Will County, and one each in DuPage and Lake Counties. Many connected to the outbreak at the Pilsen Migrant Shelter, where public health officials say efforts to get people up to date on their vaccines are going well. We have at the moment um, touched every single shelter, got 100% of those who were exposed at um, the new arrival shelters vaccinated, and already started the second um, doses for them as well. So we feel pretty confident that those who are not vaccinated have received their vaccination and therefore are protected. And since CDPH began giving vaccine doses at the landing zone a month ago, Commissioner Olasimbo Ige says not one person has declined to receive it. We have rapidly increased the number of vaccinated people, so that gives us a level of confidence. Confidence heading into the summer, which last year proved to be the peak for asylum seekers arriving in Chicago, as many as 2,000 per week. Public health officials say they are ready for that possibility this year. We are putting infrastructure and systems in place to handle that upsurge um, should it occur. We know that we have to continue to be strong and vigilant. Of course, because measles is circulating here, their message, their continued message, is to get the measles vaccine if you haven't already. Ryan Micah. All right, thanks, Jenna.